People often come to the library to use the internet, but now you can come to the library and check out the internet. Yeah, that's right, check out the internet. We have hot spots that you can take with you to check out and use away from the library. What do I have to do to check out a hot spot and how long can I keep it for? You can keep a hotspot for two weeks and all you have to do is stop by one of our four branches and bring in your library card and sign a checkout agreement. Okay, well, once I take it home and I turn it on, uh, will my wireless devices automatically connect? They're not going to connect automatically the first time. All you have to do is go under your Wi-Fi settings on your device and look for library hotspot. After that, it will connect automatically. Okay, now, in using the uh, hotspot. Are there any uh, limits to the data that I have? Do I, or is anything going to be charged to me? Is anything going to be charged to my cell phone? I mean, uh, how, how does it work? There's no charges at all and there is no data limits at all either. Uh, as long as you bring your hotspot within your two weeks, you'll be okay. All right, well, is, is there anything else I should know? I mean, uh, obviously I don't want to throw it at passing cars or things like that, but Yes, absolutely. Um, so one of the things is you can uh, connect up to 10 devices to this hotspot and this is a great device to have on a road trip or if you don't have any internet at home. Is there any limitation as to where I can use it? I mean, uh, do I have to be in a house or...? There is a few limitations. As long as there is a spread network, you'll, be, you'll have internet. Anywhere there's a spread network in the 50 states, you'll be connected. That's great. Uh, well, so... Now you know, you can check out the internet at your library. So why don't you come on in and check it out?